Another text message uh, is saying, so who were those young people? They look so much like our guys. Those polite uh, young gentlemen, you mean, are in green uniform? I already mentioned that, and I uh, mentioned that a few times before, in publicly and in my conversations with my uh, foreign colleagues. And I, uh, our task was to ensure that there are conditions for the free expression of the will of Crimeans. We had to take measures to avoid this situation developing along the way it is now going in uh, eastern Ukraine to avoid tanks, to avoid radicals and uh, nationalists uh, well armed with automatic weapons uh, behind the self-defense units of Crimea. Of course, we had our servicemen. They were acting uh, very uh, correctly, but at the same time uh, decisively and professionally. Speaking in Madrid, Lavrov repeated Moscow's assertion that armed men deployed to Ukraine's Crimea region were not Russian but self-defense forces. There are no troops whatsoever, no Russian troops. On the recent uh, reports uh, that I have, including on the uh, statement by the re representative of the president of the Russian Federation uh, for the press, uh, a decision on the use of uh, armed forces uh, on the territory of Ukraine, uh, the president of the Russian Federation has not uh, taken that decision. Thank you very much. Mr. Secretary, uh, U.S. officials have been saying that Vladimir Putin will be isolated by his actions, yet today he seemed defiant. Uh, Speaking for an hour, taking questions, he said, among other things, that Russia reserves the right to take any action to use any means, obviously military means. He described events here as an unconstitutional coup. He denied that there were any Russian troops in Crimea, occupying Crimea. He blamed the crisis on United States interference, saying that the U.S. He really denied there were troops in uh, Crimea? Yes, he did. Of course, we had our servicemen. They were acting uh, very uh, correctly, but at the same time uh, decisively and professionally.